I'm Kimberly, co-owner of the Forest River Sun Seeker you see here behind me. Um, my husband, the other co-owner, is on the camera behind you. Um, in today's video, we're going to show you how to hook up the black and gray water drain line. So, if you come over here to the side with the large slide out, is where all the utilities are located. Uh, you want to open this that says uh, this connection is for the 110, 125 volt AC, blah, blah, blah. You'll know you're in the right place. There's a little flap there that'll hold up your, your door. So what we're going to do first is we're going to put some gloves on. Um, I do provide two sets of gloves in every single rental. Uh, they are disposable. Uh, one is one set, of course, is for setup. One set is for breakdown. And just please dispose after you're done. So we're going to put on our gloves here just to keep everything nice and clean. And we're going to pull out an extra one. In case you need a little extra length. And this is the main one. And it has this piece on the one end. And it has this piece on the other end. In here, if you can get in here kind of tight. This is the black and gray water hookup. There is a little trap door down here. You want to unscrew this, and that's where your black water line is going to come through. Okay, and then you will take off this cap. Make sure these lines are pushed in. And we're going to take off this cap. And nothing should come out so this is a little tricky I like this design it is very stable and I've never had a problem with it leaking as long as I hook it up properly but it is a little tricky so what you want to do is this top sleeve here it's got a lock and an unlock here so you want to unlock this one and you do have to do this every when you set it up I've had people just attach through here. It does not drain, and that is a no-no. So you want to unlock the sleeve, just roll it down a couple of turns, twist it down a couple of turns. And then the orange one goes clockwise, and you take that off. Now what you're going to do is slide this through the bottom. Okay, through that hole. Now, this piece will not go through that hole. So if you try to put this through the hole without unscrewing it, it's not gonna work. So now what you wanna do is put this back together. You just screw it back on, counterclockwise, and then you want to take this black sleeve and you want to turn it clockwise to reattach it. Everything is back together. Then it's just the standard, slide it onto the pins that you see here, and that end is hooked up. When you get to the campground, you want to look for the black water drain. Uh, it's usually white, it usually has a little cap on it. Now this piece right here um, will fit into multiple sizes of those, I like that. So usually I just set this in. Sometimes if you get a little, give it a little turn, it'll be more stable. I usually always put some sort of a rock on top of it just to make sure it doesn't pop out at the worst possible moment. So for taking it down, breaking it down, it's just the reverse. Uh, do you want to show them about the downhill braces there? The downhill, oh yes. So I do have these downhill braces here, thank you. And this is great. You just take this to wherever your line is. We'll go this direction. We don't have a black water drain here. And you just open it up. And it's very nice. I just take it all the way to where it comes out of the hole. And you sit on here. And it gives you a nice downhill slope. And you may have to tweak it a little bit, but that's the general idea. I take it all the way down to uh, where the drain enters, or where to the line enters the drain. Fabulous. Um, so for now for taking it down, it's just everything in the reverse. 
and I'll show you on this one. Well, this just does not go through that hole. It doesn't. So again, counterclockwise for the bottom sleeve, a couple of turns. Clockwise for the orange. Take it down through the hole. This is after you've drained. Um, for draining, I guess I should have covered that. For draining, this hose on the left is the black water. The nozzle on the right is the gray water. You want to empty the black water first, close that, open the gray water, let that empty, close that before unhooking. We take it out. You screw it back on. Now the orange goes counterclockwise and the black goes clockwise. And you're all set up and ready to put it away.